During an August 22 appearance on Sirius XM's Trunk Nation with Eddie Trunk, Michael Anthony, former bassist of Van Halen, discussed his current relationship with Alex Van Halen. Anthony revealed that he hasn't been in touch with Alex. No, I haven't, Anthony said. He mentioned the last time he reached out to Alex was on his birthday in May, but didn't receive a response. Anthony decided not to persist, saying, I figured he knew that I tried to get a hold of him, so I just kind of left it at that. He added that he's now just waiting for Alex's upcoming book, Brothers, to learn more about his former bandmate. Anthony expressed surprise at the news of Alex's book, which is set to be released on October 22 by HarperCollins Publishers. When asked about his reaction to Alex writing a book, he said, I was surprised when I first heard about it. Yeah, I was very surprised. He was also taken aback by Alex's decision to auction off his gear, noting that it seemed like Alex was selling everything right down to the last drumstick and backstage pass. Anthony speculated that this might be Alex's way of achieving closure regarding Van Halen, both through the book and by parting with his memorabilia. Anthony emphasized that he has always chosen to remember the positive experiences with the band, avoiding speaking negatively about Van Halen. He hopes Alex's book will also focus on the good times. Alex, basically like myself, I've never been one to want to talk smack about the band or whatever. Because I choose to remember all the good stuff and all the good times that we had," Anthony explained. He expressed confidence that Alex's book would not delve into any dirt because Alex was never that kind of guy. Reflecting on Alex's career, Anthony noted that he never knew Alex to be someone who would play with other musicians outside of his work with Eddie. Maybe he feels that. Since his brother's gone, he doesn't feel the desire to go out and play anymore. But I can only speculate, Anthony mused. He found the auction of Alex's equipment particularly poignant, as it seemed to signify the end of any potential future Van Halen tribute projects. Despite the apparent end of Van Halen as a performing band, Anthony is looking forward to reading Brothers. He believes the book will provide insights into Alex and Eddie's relationship, especially their early years growing up and moving to the United States. The book will feature never-before-seen photos from Alex's private collection and will also be available as a 720-minute audiobook and an e-book.